Alpha 3250, NOPD 230B is on scene, requesting EMS for a female that smoked marijuana and now she's nauseous. 3250, copy. Apparently this chick smoked some weed and now she's nauseous. Dude, you know what's crazy? I thought weed helps with nausea. That's what I thought. I thought you got hungry, happy, sleepy. I thought that was the side effects of weed. I feel like there's gonna be a little more to this. You're right. That she hit that pressure and it's got her head spinning. Yeah. And now she's nauseous. That could be. Due to the spinning of the head. That is true. That can happen. 3250, we're in the area. All right. What's up, brother? What's going on with her? Just that she uh, smoked weed and she's been feeling like she wants to throw up for the last several hours. She wants to go to the hospital. She's taking medication for her ADHD. Oh, all right. This really could be anything. She could have taken something other than marijuana, and there could be a serious medical emergency underlying. And so it's really important that we assess the situation and see what's going on with this young lady. What's going on with you? I had some weed, but a really bad high. I felt like I was going to vomit, right. a panic attack on right. top of it. Do you want to go to the hospital? Yes. OK. All right, All right. so you ready? Yes. Let's go, sweetheart. No, no, Sir Truth. Sir Truth? Chartreuse. Oh, chartreuse. chartreuse. Like the, color. Like the, color. the color. That makes sense. Mm -hmm. All right. Yeah, we got the stretcher right by the door. Like, I'm going to see. Like, strapped to it. Well, we got to put seatbelts on. Seat I mean, the police here, oh, you don't want to get okay. a seatbelt okay. ticket, seat you know? <laughs> right. Now stand up. You all right? You all right? Did you ever, did you vomit yet, or you just no, felt no. like you vomited? Thank God, no. When I see someone that's having an anxiety attack, it's all about talking to them and calming them down. Okay. All she needs right now is a little love and understanding and make sure she knows there's no judgment. And so I got to ask, you just smoked weed, that was it? Yeah, uh, Nothing just, else? Just weed, just okay. weed. I mean, I had mac and cheese beforehand. Yeah. Did you smoke it? As long as you ain't smoked <laughs> no, the mac and cheese. the sauce was homemade. Oh, really? Uh, that's impressive. You make it? No, no, my sister did. She's wonderful. That's your sister that was in there with you? No, no, that was my partner. Oh, OK. So the only thing I'm gonna do right now is I'm gonna put a blood pressure cuff on you. We're gonna put, but I think you're gonna be fine. You know what? I think you kind of cleared yourself up with your anxiety attack. Yeah, because now I know there are people here to help me. We got you. I am gonna put a mask on you just because of COVID, all right? Okay. I have some nice masks, but I don't think they do their job quite right. So this is welcome. This I one's welcome. Well. But then we get this blood pressure, then we're gonna get the going, all right? Yay. So we're tight. How much weed did we smoke? Um, it was, a, it was just one blunt, but I was really? like eight puffs. So has this ever happened to you before? No, this is a new reaction. <laughs> is this your first time smoking weed? Well, yeah. the first time that it's ever actually done anything to me other than make me hungry. Y'all yeah, be good. Well, they can take the Uber yeah. up there to it. That's yeah. kind of loud. I'm sorry. I should have warned you about that. People who are on drugs of any kind. Sometimes loud noises can really throw you for a loop and give you some extreme anxiety. Look, well, I can ease your mind until you, everything looks good back here on this monitor. Yep. Well, you got I, a perfect I mean, textbook, I... perfect blood pressure. Huh. Textbooks usually have it out for me. Oh. Not for like school reasons, but because I'm of a few minority groups. So most of what I was taught back when I was in school was about racism but they sort of forgot to mention um, homophobia, transphobia, ableism, a lot of other things, just a lot of bigotry. Well, check me out. This is a textbook free zone right here. We are writing our own textbooks these days. I think her marijuana may have been a little too strong for her, but she's gonna get to the hospital. They'll give her some medicines for her anxiety, but ultimately I think this patient's gonna be fine. <laughs> to me, you're a nice high person. I like nice high people. I try to be a nice person. You are. It's like being mean takes too much energy. It's, it doesn't feel natural for me. It's just not my thing. Yeah. Plus, you got right. chartreuse with you. Yeah. They gonna check you out, yeah. and you'll be back home in no yeah. time. All right, little mama, how you feeling? I'm telling you, if all our patients are half as nice I as you, we gonna be all right. But the night's nice still young. Safe, be strong. Let's do this. Get that stretcher in here. You're gonna bleed to death. Randomizer, <laughs> randomizer. No, they're not dead. I can work with them.